So can you make money with stock videos on YouTube? In today's video, I'm going to show you guys whether you can monetize stock compilations on YouTube. Let's get started. So as you can see, one of my channels, which is the one that you're watching right now, is indeed monetized. And as you can see, it's making money every single day. Now, you probably want to do the same with stock footage. For example, those can be videos like this where you're just showing a beach. Let me quickly click on play. And that is it. So you probably wonder, can you monetize videos like this? I wish I could just give you the answer like yes or no, but it's not as black and white as that. It's kind of like a gray area where sometimes you can monetize it and sometimes you cannot monetize it. So what I'm going to do right now is show you step by step when you can and when you cannot and kind of like how that works. So first of all, by stock footage, we got to look at what kind of stock footage you mean, right? Because there are a couple of ways you can do this. First of all, you can go with free stock footage, for example, websites like Pixabay or Pexels offer you free stock footage where you can literally type in anything. For example, if I need a yacht, I quickly click on yacht, click on videos. And then as you can see, we have all of these videos that we can use in our YouTube videos. For example, let's say that we need a yacht party clip. We simply click there and then there you go. Now, these are just random clips, right? But you could also type in, um, say, Miami, and then you've got all of these clips. And then you would click on one and you can simply use these, right? Now, these are very short clips, but you also have longer clips, which I'm not sure if I can find right away, but they are out there. However, can you use them and can you monetize them? First of all, let's make clear that you can actually use them yourself without getting in trouble. So what you can see, license, free to use, no attribution required, meaning that you can simply take this video and use it yourself in your YouTube video. You won't get in trouble with copyright, so you won't get a strike. However, that doesn't mean you can monetize your videos. Can you monetize them? Yes and no. Let me get to that part. So yes, you can monetize them. If you want to use these specific clips in your videos, it doesn't mean that your channel is not going to get accepted into the YouTube Party program or you're going to get demonetized or whatsoever. If I would download this clip right now and put it in this video, I'm not going to get a strike and I'm not going to get demonetized. However, there's a difference between me using these clips in my video, which I create myself. I'm originally creating this video. I'm the original creator. I didn't download this video from the internet and put these videos in. That, that is just a part of the video. However, what happens if you only use these clips and then upload them onto YouTube? That is a lot different. There's a lot of different stuff that comes into play there. You also have paid subscription services, by the way. I use Storyblocks myself. This one is very high quality. So if I now do Yacht Party, Let's see if we can find a difference in terms of the clips that we'll find. But this one is very high quality and they have pretty much anything that you need. You know, like you type in anything on Storyblocks and it will be there. However, you can also do that. Basically, sad. can you monetize it? Yes. Can you monetize it? Once again, no. For example, if you're building a channel like this and you're only using these stock footage clips from one specific place and you let those play on repeat, you are probably not going to get accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. The reason for that is because technically anyone could then use that exact same clip because you just download them from Pexels or Pixabay or Storyblocks, whatever. If that is the video that you upload, then that is not original content and that is not within the guidelines. So these people right there are making their videos themselves, I believe. Look, buy and then they have their own website where you can probably buy that footage, as you can see an 11 hour beach video compilation. If you would download this and buy it, you would then have the rights to then use it on your video, probably. However, still, it is the exact same video as this channel. So YouTube will notice and it will probably either demonetize you or not monetize it in the first place. Because if we take a look at the guidelines, first of all, the basics, 1K subscribers, 4K hours of watch time, and then you must comply with all YouTube policies and guidelines and you have an AdSense account. If we then go even further, you can find all of these guidelines and you can see what they'll check when approving you for the monetization program. Now, they've got all sorts of systems in place where they can simply detect whether you're uploading original content or just downloading videos from the internet and then uploading that yourself or at least downloading videos from YouTube and then uploading that on YouTube as well. They'll notice and they won't monetize your channel. So now you're probably thinking, okay, so these people are still doing it. Why would they do it? Once again, these guys are probably doing it themselves. They are recording this, so it's original content. 
they own the content and because of that they're probably monetized. They're bringing about 4.5 million views in the last month which could definitely equate to $10,000 in revenue which is pretty awesome. However, can you do this yourself? Let me get to the actual point here. I've already given you some pointers here, but can you do it yourself? Yes, you can, and yes, you cannot. Don't do it if you're simply gonna go to Pixabay or Paxels, download these clips and put them just, like just download these and then upload these as well, like just a clip. However, if you start including these clips in an actual video, then you're gonna be fine. You're not gonna get demonetized for that. You can use stock footage on stock footage on stock footage, but make sure that there is an original voiceover in that video and it's not just some random music playing in the background. That is not gonna work. But if you do a original voiceover, so you've, you've got a script, you get a voiceover to read that out loud, you've got a audio file, you can then put together the video with these clips. That is not an issue. You will still get monetized. However, the problem comes in when you're starting to use clips that thousands of people or like hundreds of people are using on YouTube. Now, once again, not just one clip. It happens if you do this over and over again and keep using clips that many people are using. YouTube will then notice, they'll find out you're not making original content and that's where the issue comes in. So once again, if you're doing this and you're just downloading their videos and uploading them as stock footage, that's not gonna work, don't do that. However, if you're just creating videos like this, for example, and you have a voiceover explaining stuff about Miami and you put together a couple of different clips into one video, you are indeed probably, I cannot guarantee it, but I've been able to get monetized and it wasn't demonetized. Once again, if I download this, upload it, it wouldn't work. So make sure that the clips you're getting are from sources that you can actually trust and that you can actually use. So Storyblocks, I'm paying about $400 per year for this, but then I can use all of these clips and it has pretty much anything. Beach Party, you got it. You can just search and you got it. So make sure that you download these stock footage videos from good sources. Don't just randomly download them from the internet. Don't download them from YouTube. Use Pixabay, Paxel, Storyblocks, any good one, and then don't just put them together and put some music on it, not gonna work. Have an original voiceover and then put together a video by using the free clips, that should work. So that is pretty much that. So can you monetize it? Yes and no, it depends on the situation. So that is pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed, if you learned something from this video, please go ahead and leave a like on the video, subscribe, and then I'll hopefully, hopefully see you in the next video. Thank you so much, have a good day.